All right, guys, welcome back to the Bank of Boy Variety channel. Today's video we're going to be doing is we're going to be doing a little more gaming to the channel, adding a little more gaming to the channel here. So we're back in Minecraft here. We have a couple new additions to the world, and it's, that'll be in the next video. But um, we have a uh, one of the additions that's going to have its own video is the new update that came out, the 1.19 Wild update. So this was added to the game. Um, it might have been a while ago. It always comes out for Java Edition first. Obviously, I'm playing on Bedrock because I have a console. So it may have been out for a while. But I booted it up and the stuff um, was added in. So it always takes a little longer to, for it to uh, get added to Bedrock than it does uh, for um, Java Edition. So we're going to be showcasing it today, even though some of you probably already know this. So this is everything that's pretty much been added. Um, so I like every new update, I kind of like to uh, add some new, add, create, set up a little one of these things to show all the stuff that was added. I did one for the 1.17 caves and cliffs, 1.17 through 1.18, I think. We're running out of space in here, so we're gonna be setting it up out here. Um, so as you can see here, we got 1.19 wild update. And so, basically, with new things that were added, we're going to start um, with that, the first things here. Yank yeah, our volume up here so we can hear. Okay. So, here we have boats with chests in them. So, this was not in the game before the 1.19 update. Um, I'm not able to interact with it. There must be, like, some sort of uh, special... Unless I'm supposed to hit Y or, you know, I'm not. So I don't really know if this is interactable with. It probably is. I'm just not, haven't researched with it enough. Um, but that's that. So they added those. And they added a new type of wood here. I'm not going to walk around. I'm just going to fly because this thing activates when you walk around it. And we'll talk more about that uh, later when we get up there. They added this new type of wood here, and it's known as mangrove. So it grows in the swamps. So basically, this is a swamp update while adding some of this new stuff to the caves and then adding a new type of wood and some new animals for the swamps. So basically, they updated the swamps, adding a new type of wood, and that's this mangrove wood. It's a different type of tree that grows in the swamps, and its wood kind of looks like this inside. Kind of looks like the crimson wood from the nether, but it uh, has like regular bark and stuff. So basically, um, I'm going to have to walk here. But we have, um, what we can see there, we have um, roots for it here. Mangrove roots here, and then muddy mangrove roots. roots. And we have regular mangrove wood, uh, the stripped mangrove wood. Uh, High mangrove log, stripped mangrove log, mangrove wood planks, mangrove stairs, mangrove slab, mangrove fence, mangrove trap door, mangrove gate, mangrove door, mangrove sign, and mangrove boat. And then also the mangrove boat with chest. Okay, so that's that. Then we have this mud stuff. So we have packed mud. We have mud bricks, mud brick stairs, mud brick wall, and mud brick slab. So those have been added there. And then this is rooted dirt, I believe. I, I don't know if it was, I think it was added before this stuff, but it's rooted dirt. And I think it goes in the swamps with this, okay? Then the next couple things up here, this was added for the new caves. And that were added in the previous update, the Caves and Cliffs update. So this comes with the Warden, which is like now all of a sudden the most dangerous mob in the game. Besides the Wither and Anger Ender Dragon, you do not want to come across this guy. So he's similar. We'll spawn him in when we look at this section over here. But basically we have these new items. So this is known as Skulk here. And we have a Skulk Catalyst, which is next to it. Reinforced Deep Slate right here. Skulk Sensor, Skulk Shrieker, and Skulk Vein down here. So basically when you walk near this stuff, 
it lights the skulk sensor up when you walk and then it makes this shrieker thing shriek and it emits these little shock wave things out there. So it's kind of annoying, so that's why I'm not walking near it, but that's what it does. And then, once again for the swamps, we have these three different new types of light. And this is um, known as frog light. So this is a pearlescent frog light. We have a verdant frog light and an ochre frog light, I believe. Yeah. Okay. And then we have our non-placeable items that go into our item frames here to be showcased. So starting off, they added goat horns, which is from the goat that was added into the previous update. So it adds the goat horns, which you can obtain from the goat, I'm guessing. And these are eight different ones that make eight different sounds. So I have them all here, and we're gonna um, try them out. Okay. So we have this goat horn, it's called Ponder. Okay. We have our next one, this is known as Sing, and they have a little delay period before you can use them again. Okay. And next we have Seek. And that's the pillager horn, actually, from when you do raids and survival or in any other area. This is Feel. I believe it's the fourth one. Yeah. A couple of these are eerie at first. We have admire. We have call. So that one's kind of creepy and then it gets good at the end. Yearn. Then we have Dream. And the last one is Dream. Okay, so those are those. All right, next things we have here are the, what is this, locator compass or something? I don't know what it does. I haven't researched these items really. All I know is that just what is what it's called. Uh, recovery compass. So that may be, to, might point to your items if you die or something. I don't know. We have new music discs. This one's by Lena Rain again. She's the one who made the pig step. I don't know what this one is called. I don't know if it was added in this update. It may have been before and I just didn't pick up on it. Um, find it here. Here. So that's uh, other side. And then we have the Samuel Aberg or something, five. And then this is, you know how disc 11 is that creepy dude, he's being chased by the person, we've all heard of that. Well, this is them just trying to recreate that. So this, I, I believe this is a person in a cave being chased by a warden. So that's what this disc is. And then there's a disc fragment. So I'm guessing you have to assemble the fragments to get this disc, okay? Then we have an echo shard. And then, um, Something for the, uh, all the frogs in this game, they added frogs into the swamps. They started out as tadpoles, so this is a bucket of tadpole. Just so you know how, like, there's buckets of fish in this game. You can spawn in tropical fish or bucket of salmon or bucket of puffer fish. Well, this is a bucket of tadpoles. See the little tadpole looking out there. This is frog spawn. So, um, I tried to keep this place down, but the frogs grew up and spawned, so I had to put it in an item frame. So, basically, these are frog eggs, is what they are. You spawn them in the water, and they turn into tadpoles, and then they turn into frogs. Okay, and then we have our four new spawn eggs, the warden, the ale, frog, and tadpole. And we're going to be spawning all of them right now. So, I have them all in here. So, this is the warden. Um, we're not going to fight any of these guys or basically, yeah. So I believe that all these skulk shriekers and when you're walking, they'll make sounds letting him know that you're there. So he can like hear your character. He picks up on the noises you make and then he'll come after you. So you're pretty much going to have a couple um, turds flying out your into your pants when you see this guy coming at him. Because he does high damage. He'll kill you in like two hits. And he's very hard to kill. He takes like 20 hits with a unenchanted netherite sword. So he's quite dangerous. 
And then we have some, I don't know if this guy's friendly or not. That's the ally. Probably not friendly. Frog, I think these guys attack you. And he does attack all the guys. Okay, we're going to get away from him for a second there. Avoid some of that noise. Alright, and then these are tadpoles. So that's what all the frogs start out as. Okay? So that's going to be it for today's video, guys. So please like and subscribe as it helps out the Bano War Variety channel. And stay tuned for our next video showing you the new additions to our world. And real quick, we'll just put these tadpoles in this water so you can just see what they look like. Some frogs in there. Okay? And then they'll swim. They're dying from the lava, but yeah. Okay? Alright. So stay tuned for our next video.